Invasive Species and the American Bullfrog You'll often hear about invasive species when learning about the world around us, but what exactly is an invasive species and how do they affect our environment? To learn, we can take a look at one invasive species that has made a new home right here in California, the American Bullfrog, or simply the Bullfrog for short. You might not be able to notice it at first glance, but these frogs have a big appetite, which has created an even bigger problem for native amphibian species. But what is an invasive species anyway? To be considered invasive, a species has to be moved from their normal home to somewhere new, and this is almost always due to human activity. Once introduced, the presence of an invasive species will cause harm to its native environment around it. This can easily be seen in the bullfrog. Originally coming from the eastern areas of North America, they were introduced to California in the early 1900s as a source of food. Eventually escaping from their captivity, they quickly ate their way across most of the state. As an invasive species, bullfrogs pose a great threat to native amphibians, such as the yellow-legged and the red-legged frog. Bullfrogs create this threat to native amphibians through a simple way, by eating. They are known for their near endless appetite, hiding in wait and then attacking nearly anything that passes them by. Bullfrogs have a habit of eating anything they can fit in their mouths, ranging from food such as insects and worms to small birds, mammals, and even other amphibians. Not even their own kind is safe, as cannibalism is quite common among bullfrog populations. And this creates a problem for our native species, as the two groups share a similar diet. The yellow-legged or the red-legged frog may live alongside the invasive newcomer, but the bullfrogs are able to outcompete native species in the race for food at all stages of their life cycle. An average bullfrog will eat a minimum of 13 crickets a day, or one mouse a week just to survive, making 47-45 crickets or 48 mice in an, an entire year. This is just a single bullfrog. With a larger population, their environment turns into one huge bullfrog buffet, the native species starving with nothing left to eat. To make matters worse, bullfrogs are not above viewing their fellow amphibians as a potential meal. Native species not only have to deal with the greatly reduced food supplies, but possible predation by a bigger frog. And when looking towards the future of our native amphibians in California, we should look for solutions to end this bullfrog invasion if we don't want our native species to croak.